5 screen layout. In this video, we are presenting a demo to create an asymmetric video wall layout of 5 screens using SynClan. Double click on the SynClan Manager shortcut button on the desktop and enter the password. The password is what you set at the time of first run of the SynClan Manager. On the top of the SynClan Manager, you will see 4 options. Add Group, Add Player, Find Player and Playlist. Firstly, we need to set up the players. There are two ways of adding a player. One is by using the Add Player option, where we can add players one by one using their IP addresses and other is by using the Find Player button. Add the found players by using the right-click options. Select the Acquire Player option to add players individually or just use the Acquire All option to add all the found players in one go. You will be prompted to enter the player password while acquiring the player. Now, we will need to create a group and move the added players to this new group so as to make the video wall. Click on the Add Group button on Toolbar. Fill in the name and location details of the group. Here, we are giving the name SynClan Demo. You do not have to change the advanced setting. Once you save the group, it will appear on the left side of the screen as we can see. Now, drag and drop players one by one into the created group. By default, the first player added to group will be the master player. You can change the master player of the group in the group settings. Kindly note, master player is used to synchronize all the players of the group and is not a part of the video wall. Now we are going to create the playlist. Firstly, we are going to send a grid image to set the design of the asymmetric video wall. Click on the playlist button on the toolbar to open playlist creator. Click on new and enter the playlist name and description. Click on save. Add the grid image to the playlist. Save the playlist and close the playlist creator window. Assign the playlist in the schedule tab and click on publish. Start the publish process. Now we can see our grid on the video wall. Go to the design tab and click on live stage modification so that the changes that I am doing in the design is also changing live on the actual video wall. When live stage modification is enabled, each of the screen shows live stage modification written on the top right corner of the screen. According to the measurements, height, width and bezel of my screen, I have calculated the screen size in millimeters and the stage size keeping in mind that my screens have resolution 16 is to 9 aspect ratio. In the first go, I will be using approximations to set the X and Y coordinates and rotation of the screens. Then, I will do minute changes in X and Y coordinates and rotation to achieve accurate grid layout. According to my video wall layout, I am changing the stage size and size of the screens. Because all my screens are of same size, I will set dimensions for one screen and paste it on the other screens. First, I will arrange all my screens horizontally. I can see changes live on video wall as I change them in the manager. So, I will be doing the changes as per my grid in the manager. Now, I am moving my bottom three screens down and changing the rotation angle to 90 degrees.
Same way, I am trying to adjust the screens according to the grid sent on the video wall by changing the X and Y coordinates and rotation angle of the screens. The next playlist that we will send will have this stage design applied to the playlist. Click on playlist to add a new playlist with actual video. Create a simple playlist. In the stage cropping settings, enable stage cropping checkbox. Click on save. Add the videos to the just created playlist and save the playlist. Close the playlist creator window. Once we are done adjusting the layout, disable the live stage modification. You will get a prompt that the changes will be reset to original state. Just click on OK. Select the created playlist from the drop down in the schedule tab. Assign and publish the playlist. Click on Start to start the publish process.